Hey guys, I'm Silverwolf and in this video we're going to be unboxing 12 of these Kitty Corner uh, little candy cat crates. Now if you remember when I came back from Turkey I brought back with me some Kitty Condo cat crates and I tried to find if I could buy some for myself because I liked them and I wanted some more. Unfortunately I couldn't find anywhere to buy them in the UK, they're either in America or Canada but I have a good friend in America, uh, Serge, hi Serge, you're probably watching this. Um, who offered to get them for me and send them to me um, in exchange for some artwork. So I did some artwork and uh, got these in return. So they arrived yesterday, it took a while but of course they had a quite a long journey. Um, so I'm going to be opening all of them and we'll see which cats we get. Now I did say that uh, this was going to happen and uh, if anyone who wanted to see me do this and a few of you wanted to see it so I thought why not it gives me another sort of video to do um, I can't really do any sort of um, packaging comparison but um, they are made by the same company as the kitty condos the only difference between these and the kitty condos uh, in Turkey is that the kitty condos don't come with the candy uh, the American and Ki Canadian kitty corner ones come with candy and I'm guessing that the Turkish ones don't come with the candy because it's to do with I don't know importing food or whatever so there's the cats you can get. The two that I have already are these two. Um, so we'll see if we can get the others two. Theoretically, and it probably won't be uh, the case, but theoretically I should have two of each. But I've no doubt I'll probably be missing one by the end. I don't know. So we'll open up the packaging. Now this is the sort of thing, obviously you can see that if you had a shop you would buy a few of these to sell in your shop. They are the bulk buy things. So um, this obviously that would, would sort of fold over and it would become a display for them. So that's what we've got inside. You're going to have four pink, four orange and four green. So we'll get them all out. I will. I can always store them in the uh, in this box as well, which is quite useful. It keeps them all tidy after I've unboxed them. Okay, so an army of cats. Right. From what I can tell, the packaging is the same as the uh, Kitty Condo ones. It still says collect them all on the front here. Just get it to focus on that instead of what's behind it. There we go, which shows you each cat. Kitty Corner, and obviously the uh, Turkish one was Kitty Kondo. You can see there, and that. And these ones also have a little sticker here that's the lot number, and also best before date because they contain candy, which the others did not have. And you can actually, you can still, I think you can still, I oh know it's not quite as easy to see through the, uh, the holes in the back to see what you have. So let's start with this one then. using my teeth to help it get, get it open. Um, the other ones open much more quickly. The weird thing is with this is you would expect it to have some sort of a little um, perforated thing so it's easier to to uh, just kind of like get it open. Um, so that's what we have. So we'll take off the cardboard thing from around it. And you can see there's that there. But you can see the cat is there with the candy. So if we take this, open the front. The candy is shaped like fish. Get the focus on that. There we go. The fish candies. It's kind of like your regular sort of fizzy candy, I would imagine. And the cat we've got in this. Well, what do you know? It's it's the cat I already have. It's the first one I actually unboxed when I came back from Turkey. There he is. And the piece of paper that you get with it tells you about the cats. And it's not in Turkish this time. So we've got Bella. She is a playful loving lap cat. She likes to get cozy and will cuddle for hours. And you also have it in, I think that's Spanish there as well. I do not know Spanish. 
but funnily enough it came up on my Facebook memories um, seven years ago I was actually in Spain and um, we didn't go to a part of Spain that was very touristy so we had to learn Spanish because they wouldn't serve you or even talk to you unless you knew Spanish so there was that right so we'll pop Bella back in I'll leave the candy out because obviously well the candy is all going to get eaten so I'll put that to one side so we've got the next little green carrier I'm just going to, I'm not going to talk through all of this because it will just take too long. So I'm just basically doing the same with these as I did with the first one. This cat's ginger, I can see its paws sticking out here. Of the trying to escape. Um, candy. And this one, funnily enough, the, uh, the little information thing about it is kind of scrumpled in there. And here's the little ginger cat. He's quite cute. There he is. He looks shocked. He's seen something. He's a bit worried, that one. He's quite nicely painted and detailed. And I'll read you the information about the ginger one. It says, Oliver. Oh, like from Oliver and Company. Even tempered, intelligent and playful, he will in instigate a game with anything available. Let's do this one next. So, so far we've got two different ones. And the next one is an orange one. And you can see the cat is hidden, but if you look this way. It's a little cat and it's lying down. Well, obviously it's a little cat, of course. You know, it's not going to be a dog, is it? And it looks like a Persian cat. You can see. He looks a bit unsure and worried as well, doesn't he? I like that they've done fur on the bottom of the cat as well as the top. It reminds me of those kitty in my pocket toys you used to be able to get back in the 90s. Um... This one is Duchess, sweet, quiet and gentle. He likes his own space and watches from afar. And he's a boy, despite being called Duchess. Good for him. So I'll pop that one back in. And open this next one. Now oh, this one's a bit easier. Oh, it's not the same usual thing. Oh, it's Duchess again. You can see his tail there. And there he is. So we've got two of Duchess. Now if I peel this bit off as well. The issue is when you peel the, uh, I peeled off the, the label on the front of the carrier. The issue is with this is um, it leaves like a sticky residue as you can see and um, you can get rid of that with lighter fluid which is how you can uh, get rid of sticky residues and stuff but lighter fluid doesn't always agree with plastic and so this one is a bit more difficult to get into um, it might be wise to really hard to get into. It's kind of sticking to me, it's kind of static. Uh, it might be wise to test it on a piece of, like a hidden piece of plastic first before you sort of go in. Although it tends to only be clear plastic, it just makes it a bit frosted um, because it eats through the plastic. This is a different one. So let's see who this one is. Take out the candy. Kind of little flat cat. Sort of flaked out on the ground there. And that one is Max. Loves to get into mischief and purrs when content. She will keep you entertained. So that's Max. So, so far we've got one of each there, but we do have two of Duchess. Um, 
The next one. I wonder how many of these I'll have to open before I get a full set. Take off the cardboard. And this one here. Where's the cat? Ah, he's there. And that's the same as I've already got. It's that one. So that's another double, so we'll put that one with Duchess. Okay, so we have two more cats to find. Well, actually, to be fair, we have one more cat to find because don't forget, I had a couple of cats. I had the calico cat and that black and white cat um, when I went to Turkey. So I'm actually only missing one. But from this set, I'm missing two. Oh, we've got a black cat in this one. There he is. Get them out. This one was perfect for Halloween. Uh, read about him. Oh, it's a girl. Roxy. She is inquisitive and sleek. She loves to be around people and is very affectionate. So that's another one. So I actually have a full set of the cats now. But from this particular box, we are still missing the calico cat. Oh no, we are not missing the calico cat because there he is. So that's that one. So I have a full set of cats from this box. And I will read, you, read about the uh, calico one. Cooper, he is athletic, strong and very active. Loves to climb everything and is very loyal. So that leaves us with these four kitty condos or cat carriers. And let's see who we get in these. So Duchess is just in the orange one. And I'll swap these ones over because I actually got this one in my in my green one that I got before. So I actually have I have two green ones with the sky inside. But both the Duchess cats came in the orange one. And this one is, is the ginger one again. So let's see. There he is. And I have two of the ginger one now, and the other one was in the green carrier. So the cat you get doesn't sort of apply to the carrier colour. Like, you can get any cat in any colour carrier. Even though Duchess seems to be just in the orange ones. And this one is... You can't see. That was the calico one again. So... There we go. of the calico so I actually because um, the other calico that I got from Turkey also came in a pink carrier so I actually have two of him in the pink carrier now as well I mean you can just sw swap them over you don't have to keep them in the, the color that they come in anyway obviously the carriers aren't personalized I'm gonna do our next orange one and this one is Duchess again. So I've got three of Duchess now. He must be a popular one. There he is. And they all came in orange carriers. And finally, this is Duchess again, I'm going to scream. The final orange carrier contains... Oh, it's a little cat that's lying on his tummy. There we go. 
So, what colour carrier did that one come in last? It's the black cat. Oh, the little pink carrier. So, I've, uh, these are the, these are all the, uh, the little carriers containing ones that don't, that aren't swaps. And then we've got the swaps here. So we've got that guy, and we've got Duchess twice, and the orange ones. Um, the little ginger one, the calico, and this one's hiding. There we go, that one as well. So the only one that I don't have two of is the black one, because I had three of Duchess. I only have one little black cat, and the others are all... It's just so you do get roughly two of each in the box I think um, and that's pretty much that but of course I do have three calicos and three of the uh, little sort of purring black and white one as well and so there you go I have unboxed all of them and I have a complete set which is pretty cool and I have loads of candy I hope the candy is nice because if it's not, I'm going to be sad. But I can always give it to my boyfriend, I suppose. Or my parents, maybe. Um, so there you go. I hope you've enjoyed watching these. I won't keep you any longer. It's been quite a long video. Um, if you want to see the other, the other video that I did of them, it's linked below. And I think Rare Finds is also linked below as well. Because they're not particularly rare. Well, I suppose they are in my country. But um, yeah, it's just a playlist to put it on, I suppose. If you want to check out my Etsy and new Monday stores, feel free. I uh, do plushies and take commissions and custom artwork. I do that as well. Or you can buy me a coffee on Kofi if you enjoy what I do. All tips help and are very much appreciated. That's all for this video. Stay safe, stay healthy and keep being awesome. This is Silver signing off.